Hi there, thanks for joining us tonight on TCM. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Up next, our TCM import, a Sunday night staple. This month, we've been showcasing the films of the unconventional French writer-director Robert Bresson. This week, we have his acclaimed fable about a passive donkey bearing the cruelties of mankind. From 1966, it's Awasad Balthazar. If you're looking for sunshine and flowers, Robert Bresson is not the director for you. But if you want an intense and cerebral look at humanity, he's your man. Bresson had a singular style he developed through his pursuit of what he called cinematography. He wasn't referring to the traditional concept of cinematography used to describe how a film is shot. Bresson used the term to describe the art of capturing his actors' movements, taking out all elements of theatricality. To achieve this level of control, Bresson rarely used professional actors, preferring to cast people he trained just for their parts. In fact, he called them models, not actors. In Awasad Balthazar, there are plenty of models, but the focus is on the title character, a donkey named Balthazar. It's a heartbreaking story, influenced chiefly by the work of the Russian novelist Dostoevsky, about the donkey going through life experiencing brief respites of love, but mostly enduring brutality at the hands of the humans he encounters. But regardless of how he's treated, Balthazar perseveres with a kind of dignity in his powerlessness. Filmmaker and critic Jean-Luc Godard described the film as, quote, the world in an hour and a half. And here it is from 1966, Awasad Balthazar. <laughs> 